What's up everybody, Nathaniel Morton here, and within this video, I'm going to teach you the top five vertical jump training exercises that you can do to increase your vertical jump and jump higher using nothing but resistance bands. So by the end of this video, you'll be able to go down into the description of this video, click the link and get these resistance bands for yourself, and then do this workout for yourself. And I want you to know that I have used these same five exercises to increase my own vertical jump to the point where I am dunking with two hands, throwing myself alley-oops, and everything of the sort. So these five exercises definitely work. I also want you to know that I have the full workout version of these same five exercises, meaning that I have recorded myself doing every single set, every single rep, and you can follow along with me if you like, and I will put that down in the description as well, as well as on a card right here. But let's jump into the video. Get it? Jump into the video. Okay, so right here I'm doing what are called band jumps. So I've attached my resistance bands to two miniature dumbbell racks. You can also attach your resistance bands to two dumbbells, you can attach them to two railings, anything that works that are equal distances apart and allows you to jump in the middle of them. Also, after I do those five jumps, I'm going to superset it by taking the weight belt and the resistance bands off and doing five normal jumps. Moving on to this next exercise. This next exercise is called band pull-throughs. Okay, we are going to do three sets of 15 reps of these band pull-throughs. And I forgot to mention for the band jumps, we are also going to do three sets of five reps. So three sets of five reps for the band jumps and three sets of 15 reps for the band pull-throughs. Now, what you want to do here is focus on your hamstrings. So you want all of your weight to be in your heels. You want to... Pull the resistance band through your legs, use your lower back, make sure your back is straight, You're not, you don't want to be rounding your back, and focus on your hamstrings. So three sets of 15 reps, this is going to do wonders for your hamstrings in your lower back and you will be feeling it. Moving on to the next exercise. This is called band good morning. So I step on the bands, I pull it up over my shoulders as I face forward for you here so you can see what I'm going to do. And... I basically keep my legs straight and I hinge at the waist. So I put my hands up, I'm hinging at the waist. I also want to focus on this exercise, weight in my heels, all of my focus is in my hamstrings once again. You will feel this in your hamstrings and your lower back. When we're trying to increase our vertical jump, it is very important that we have core strength. Part of your core is your lower back. Your core is not only your abs, it's also your obliques and your lower back, which these exercises target very, very well. So you're going to do these for three sets of 15, and after you do each set, you're going to superset them with, as you see right here, band squats. So you'll do... You'll do one set of 15 with the band good mornings and then superset it with one set of 15 of the band squats. Then you'll do that again for an extra two sets. So a total of three sets of band good mornings and three sets of band squats. And I will definitely write everything down on the screen because I can already tell that this is probably confusing. The very last exercise that we have here. These are called monster walks. So you take one resistance band, you fold it in half, and you put it around your ankles. Now, I noticed in this video, which you're about to see when I do this exercise, that I did not squat down far enough in this exercise. So you are going to want to squat down farther than I squat down as you are walking. And if I get a move on here so I can actually explain the exercise, um, Obviously, I was a little bit tired. Um, so I'm doing monster walks. You want to squat down farther than this to where your, your knees are at a 90 degree angle. If you look, my knees are not at 90 degrees. My butt is not down low enough. So you should definitely squat lower. You are going to do these for three sets of 15 steps. 
down and back. So 30 steps total. So 15 steps down, 15 steps back, pushing out at the ankles. And this has been the top five exercises that you can do with resistance bands to increase your vertical jump.